back to my channel. Thanks so much for tuning in for another video. If you're new, welcome and don't forget to subscribe. If you're already subscribed, welcome back. So for today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you all of my product empties and somewhat empties for 2018. This is going to be a showcase of all the products I have used over the course of this year, products that I purchased that I liked. So I'm going to share with you what I liked about the product, why I purchased the product. And I'll also be sharing with you if I didn't too much care for the product and why I didn't too much care for the product. And at the end of the video, I'm going to finish it up with my favorite hair care company that topped my list for 2018 and products that are going to be a definite that will be carrying over until 2019. So I have a lot of stuff and I'm going to try to work this quickly but we're just going to jump right into it because there is a lot. Okay so this is not going to be in any particular order. I'm just going to start pulling products out and just going through them very briefly. So here we go. Okay so the first thing I have here is from the Talia Wajid. I think I said that right. Talia Wajid Curly Curl Cream. So I got this product because I've heard a lot of talk about it as far as the curl definition that it gives so I gave it a try. And this is a product I can say is really worth the money. It did not leave any residue in my hair, no flakes at all. It is a heavy type of a, a curl cream. This curl cream gave crazy definition. So it does say extreme curl definition, no buildup or frizz. And I will say the product claims the truth. So I really like this product. So next we have the Camille Rose Naturals. This is the Almond Jai Twisting Butter. I've used this product a couple times and I really liked it. It is pretty thick. So I got this product because I love to do flat twists on my hair a lot and this gives really great definition once it dries and it smells really good, leaves your hair smelling really good. So I had no problems with this product at all. It is a product that I really enjoyed for 2018. This was actually my first time trying it this year. So if you're looking for a product that gives you a really great twist out and braid out or just a flat twist in general, I would say that this Almond Jot Twisting Butter is definitely one that you want to try. Okay, so this is another one that uh, I really liked and for whatever reason they stopped selling in Walmart. But it's the Daily Defense and I'm, I'm a big fan of all Daily Defense products. They are very inexpensive and you get a lot for the money. And this product also gives you a lot of slip as well. So that's another reason why I like this product because of the slip and it just feels really good. It makes your hair really, really soft. It's sulfate free. Um, I'm pretty sure it has parabens or whatever, but it's sulfate free. But it's a really great conditioner if you're just looking for just a cheap, um, inexpensive conditioner. This is definitely one uh, that is a go-to and I wish I could get it elsewhere because I would still buy it if I could, but they're hard to find or they just stopped selling them. But I think the dollar store may still have them. I don't know, but definitely uh, Daily Defense has some really great conditioners and shampoos if you're just looking to get a lot of product for the money this is definitely a must okay so another conditioner i have is the tea tree triple threat invigorating conditioner this is from the giovanni uh, eco chic eco chic hair care and this is for all hair types this is a really great conditioner because i love the tingling sensation that it leaves on my scalp it's very moisturizing it's very hydrating it has a lot of great slips so this is another great conditioner that I would highly recommend as well as well as the shampoo I don't have the shampoo um, in the box but the shampoo is really good as well but this is good for all hair types and it has rosemary peppermint eucalyptus just a really great ingredients if you just want that nice cooling sensation on your scalp really great conditioner so the next product I have here is by May Beautiful this is from the Inspire line this is the leave-in detangling conditioner and this product is just about gone. When I first tried this product, I did not like it. It just did not seem to do well on my hair. But I gave it another try. Some months later, I gave it a try. And for whatever reason, it just really likes my hair now. I don't know. <laughs> but um, it has shea butter, honey, coconut oil, chamomile, and sage. Um, it's just a really great detangling conditioner. Um, it does have slip in it now that I've noticed on my hair. It has a really great slip. And it does detangle my hair. It's very conditioning, very nourishing. Um, and it's pretty good for all hair types to be quite honest and there's no sulfates with this uh, product there's no paraben so this is a really great detangling product I would highly recommend this so another great product I have grown to love is from TGIN this is their rose water curl refresher and this product is just about gone as well and I haven't even had it that long so this works really great on my hair it definitely softens and conditions my hair really well and it just prepares my hair for my styles. It also has green tea in it and um, it definitely leaves my hair shiny and it just makes my curls feel really good and just very conditioned. So this is another product I would highly recommend as well. So another leave-in conditioner that I pulled out of the box is from the um, Moisture Miracle, African Pride Moisture Miracle. This is the Coconut Milk and Honey Hydrate and Shine Leave-In Conditioner. This product you have to shake uh, to mix up the ingredients. 
and this is what it looks like. I don't know if I have reviewed this product before, but this is what it looks like. And I have used a great deal of this product. It's definitely at the very bottom there. Um, to be quite honest, I did not like this product. Now, why I was still using it, I don't know. But because, I don't know, this product does not mix well with other products, especially like gels and con other conditioners. Um, it definitely does not mix well, and it would always leave white residue in my hair. So, just as a standalone, it feels good just by itself, but if you have any other product in your hair, it will definitely leave some residue. So, it's okay, but... I don't know, I just don't really care for it, so I will not be repurchasing this product. Okay, so next we have the Coconut Co-Wash from As I Am. This is definitely a staple. I have shown this product probably numerous times in different videos. This is a favorite among the uh, natural hair community. This is a cleansing product, so it does help to, of course, cleanse my hair, condition my hair, keep my hair bright, nice and moisturized. And it also serves as a great um, pre-poo for me because I like to detangle my hair before shampooing or if I don't do a shampoo at all, I'll use this product and I mean it just leaves my hair feeling really good. Or if I don't do a shampoo, it just makes the rest of my wash day and my styling just that much easier. So this is definitely a staple. Highly recommend this product. On to the cheaper side of products. This I got from the dollar store. This is the VO5 uh, 5 Vitamin Formula. Um, this one has vitamin E, vitamin H, vitamin C, vitamin B5, vitamin vitamin B3. But if you're looking for a very moisturizing conditioner, just inexpensive and very cheap, other than the Daily Defense, I would highly recommend this from VO5, uh, Strawberries and Cream. They're moisturizing conditioner, and it's very moisturizing, and it's very conditioning, and it has great, great slip. Can't hold on to the bottle. Okay, so next is from Jane Carter Solutions. This is their Revitalizing Leave-In Conditioner. And I am actually out of this product completely. I mean, it is dry. What I like about this product is that it does not disturb my curls. It does not disturb my hairstyles when I want to refresh my hair. I'll just spritz this in my hair and it just livens the curls and reactivates the products. But it does not weigh down my curls or uh, straighten out my curls to where, you know, I lost a lot of my definition. It smells absolutely amazing. It smells like flowers, <laughs> like a flower arrangement. It smells so good. So it is a detangler. It's also a heat protectant. So I really do love this product and I do highly recommend this one as well. So for my hair growth products, I have from Natural Sisters. This is their Mega Growth Elixir. I have shown this product numerous times. Um, I think I've seen it enough in my videos. But this is definitely a go-to oil that I really enjoy. It has all natural ingredients in here that stimulate and promote hair growth. So this product has 34 natural ingredients and 15 organic herbs. And you can see all the herbs that were left over in the bottle once I used it all. This is a really great scalp and hair oil. It's very lightweight and it's also very absorbent. But this is an oil that will always be a go-to for me. So from Texture ID, and I have done a video on this before, this is their 3 times Moisture Cream Conditioner plus Honey for all hair types. And this one is almost gone. So I did a video on some of the products in this line. It's a pretty decent conditioner. It is very moisturizing. 3 times the moisture. It was moisturizing is all I can say. It was, a, it was an okay product. Um, I would use this if I'm just trying to detangle my hair before I shampoo. Um, other than that, it's not one that really was... I don't know. I don't know. I, I just I just wouldn't buy this product again. It was okay while I had it, but yeah. <laughs> another product from Eden Body another product from Eden Body Works is their almond marshmallow. This is the hydration serum. And I'm completely out of this, but this is their hydration serum. And this is definitely a go-to for me, especially in the summertime when I'm doing wash and goes. What I like about this product is the slip that it has. It definitely has amazing slip. It's very hydrating on my hair, very moisturizing, um, very lightweight. It gives my hair a lot of great shine and definition. This is one I would recommend as well if you're wanting to do a really great wash and go. So the next product is from Natural Sisters. This is their Tea Tree and Rosemary Treatment. Um, this is a really great product and this product is for stimulating hair growth. I've used it pretty much all up. 
let sit right there so I have definitely gone through this jar this was just a small size but they do have it in a bigger jar so this product says that it prevents dandruff hydrates thirsty hair stimulates hair growth and it's very nourishing just made my scalp and my hair just feel so good it smells amazing when you open it up it just opens up your your nose and your senses it just it's just very um, invigorating oh gosh it smells so good and, and I'm stopped up right now, so that's why I'm sniffing it because I'm smelling the peppermint and the and the tea tree, and it's just opening my nose up like a menthol. But this is an amazing product, so I highly recommend from Natural Sisters their tea tree rosemary treatment. So another great product that I really love when I want a great protein treatment is from the Myel Organics Babasu and Mint Deep Conditioner. Uh, this is for dry, damaged hair, and it's a protein and moisture replenisher. And this product is good for all hair types and I have gone through several of these jars and this is one of them so this protein treatment is definitely a staple it's also very stimulating on your scalp and just gives a really nice tingling sensation and feel on your scalp so this is a really really great uh, product and deep conditioner so definitely check it out Myel Organics once again their Babasu Babasu mint deep conditioner Another great product that I have in my stash here is from TGIN. This is their Honey Miracle Hair Mask. This is a really great deep conditioner. It definitely leaves your hair extremely moisturized and soft and conditioned. And it's just an overall really great deep conditioner. If you're looking for one, this is definitely it. And this product has raw honey and olive oil in it. This is definitely one I would highly recommend if you have low porosity hair. So from Kiki Curly Not Today, this is another product I felt also that was um, hyped up. This is their Natural Leave-In Detangler. This particular product leaves all kinds of residue in my hair. It doesn't matter if it's just this product alone in my hair or other products. It always leaves residue. This product would just not penetrate in my hair very well. I don't know why, but yeah, I won't be buying this again. All right, so that completes that part of the video. So now we're going to talk very quickly, very briefly about products that I really like and that will carry over into 2019. And these are products not only that I like, but these are products that I would definitely repurchase again. So first up I have from the As I Am line. This is the new line that they had released, which is their dry, itchy scalp care. This is the tea tree leave-in conditioner and the co-wash that they have. So I have come to love both of these products for a couple reasons. One, because the product claims are true. So if you have dry, itchy scalp, my scalp in the middle definitely is always itching. It helps and it alleviates that itch and that dryness. It leaves your hair very soft, very moisturized, and just a really great feeling on your hair just overall and on your scalp overall. So the product claims, me personally, are true with these two products. I will be repurchasing once um, they are completely empty. So yes, these are going to be my carryovers for 2019 that will stay in my natural hair stash. Another product that will remain in my natural hair stash for 2019 is from the Wetline Extreme. This has become a very popular hair gel and very inexpensive hair gel compared to the Eco Styler gel. I will say that the hold on this gel is definitely a more firmer hold than what you would get with the Eco Styler gel. I probably won't be going back to the Eco Styler gel anytime soon after using this product because this is so moisturizing and it has a really great hold without a very hard crunch at all like I didn't really get a hard crunch with this product it gives you hole but it's not like a crunchy hole to me at least to my hair it's not a crunchy hole so it's still soft and um, it has aloe vera in it it doesn't have any alcohol and it does not leave residue in your hair uh, which it does state on here so this is a really really great gel compared to Eco Styla gel so this will be carrying over into 2019 so the next products that will be carrying over to 2019 which are my favorite products is all from the TGIN line. So from their leave-in conditioner, to their buttercream, to their hair mask, to their deep conditioners. Yeah, this entire line, both collections. All of their products are so moisturizing, so hydrating before, when you put it in your hair, after you put it in your hair, days after you've used their products. It just leaves your hair very, very conditioned and very, very nourished. So 
always a fan none of their products have done my hair wrong they always get my hair right every time zero complaints about this brand and this company so i will forever be a fan of tgin and their products will always be in my natural hair stash another great product that will probably ultimately take the place of all shampoos that i've ever purchased before would be from the shangren valley soap and salve company this is their ayurvedic um ayurvedic herb shampoo for strong healthy silky hair this has got to be the most moisturizing shampoo bar I have ever used. Actually, this is the only shampoo bar I've ever used. And it is the most moisturizing, it is the most cleansing and conditioning, nourishing shampoo bar. And this is just the trial size of this. And I mean, I can get tons of uses out of this product, probably more so than just a regular um, bottled shampoo. This particular shampoo bar does promote hair growth. All of the ingredients that are in this uh, shampoo bar promote uh, healthy hair growth so and stronger hair as well. So definitely will remain in my natural hair stash for 2019. Another carryover product for 2019 is going to be from the Apogee Curlific Texture Treatment, which I am getting to the bottom of this. This is an amazing product. This is a protein treatment product and this product improves the elasticity in your hair it repairs uh damaged curls coils and waves especially if you have color treated hair but i use this at least once a week when i want that extra curl definition when i want my curls to pop and also to repair any damage uh, to my hair it just gives my curls just that extra boost of curl definition without me really having to put any um, product in my hair so this will forever 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 remain in my natural hair stash so that completes all of my products for 2018 so to end 2018 I'm just going to end it by just letting you know who my favorite natural hair company is drum roll okay that was a horrible drum roll so my favorite natural hair company for 2018 is TGIN yay TGIN, hands down, is definitely my favorite natural hair company for 2018. Going into 2019, they're just an amazing company. They have an amazing brand. Please don't sleep on TGIN. They are absolutely phenomenal when it comes to their products. I just want to say, first of all, thank you guys that have subscribed to my channel, that have viewed my content for 2018. This has been two years now that I have been on YouTube and I have over 5,000 subscribers and I have nothing but you guys to thank for that. You subscribe, you enjoy the content, you've been watching and just engaging with me. So I really thank you guys so much for the love that you've shown. My little channel took off quite a bit in two years. So for over 5,000 people in two years, I would say that's pretty good. Um, I'm still working on my goal of 10,000 subscribers. That's gonna be my next goal. So hopefully it won't take two more years to get to that level. So I just wanna leave you guys by saying Happy New Year's. I hope you have a safe and happy New Year's. I hope you have a blessed 2019. And I just wish you nothing but just much love, success, and happiness, and just everything that your heart desires for 2019 and beyond. So it's been real, it's been fun for 2018, but 2019 is gonna be even better. So with that said, if you liked this video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. It's just Janine. I will see you guys, Lord willing, 2019. Happy New Year! Bye guys.